Hello. So, no more miserable. Well, that's a lie. I can't promise that. There's always going to be misery because this is me and I have mental illness, so I can't just switch it off. Um, <clears throat> so, today, our plans are the same as yesterday and the day before that and the day before that. Basically, fuck all because we can't leave the house. It is only like day 10, I think. Boredom is starting to set in a little bit. I think Edie's birthday is going to provide me with A, some amusement. It's going to keep me busy because I've got to wrap her presents and I'm going to try and think of ways to make it special. Um, so her presents are being dropped off um, outside my house because they're at my mum's house at the moment. Her presents are being dropped off at the weekend um, at the end of my driveway. So yeah, I'll have her presents to wrap and I'm going to try and do some balloons as well to make it, you know, nice. So that will keep me amused or out of mischief for a little bit. Um, yeah, Edie's in a super happy mood today, which is nice, although she has just fallen over because toddlers do that a lot. So she was crying for about 30 seconds and then she's playing with her blocks again. She's probably doing something naughty, but I'm she's happy, so I'm just going to let her do mischief. Hey, baby. Yeah? No, it's not Nana, and I'm talking to myself. Yeah, no, it's not a fishy. It's Dumbo on my T-shirt. Look, it's Dumbo. Do you like yeah. it? Yeah. Dad. Dumbo, yeah. Do you like him? He's our favourite, isn't he? Ah, He's cute, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, that's my breast, darling. Well done. It's Dumbo. He's sweet, isn't he? So, this is... This is the print, the quote that is on the print in Edie's room. And it's also exactly the same font. And it says, if I know what love is, it's because of you. Um, so, yeah. If you would like to see an updated tattoo video, um, that's something that I can talk about at some point, because I think I've shown you most of my tattoos that I've got in previous videos. Um, but I don't know, this is one of my favorites. I love that one. I do love that one. Um, I want to try and get Edie out in the garden a little bit because we didn't really get out in the garden yesterday. Um, the problem is my garden is kind of shielded both sides so it doesn't get much sun. And thank you also, I had, I've had some really nice comments on my videos, um, especially yesterday because of being sad and everything. I had some really nice comments, especially about like, my music and stuff. And I'm hoping to get some music stuff done. I want, that's trouble. I want to get into more of a routine and get the house a bit more sorted, um, which is an ongoing issue. And then I want to dedicate Edie's nap time to doing music. But at the moment, I've either got jobs to do or I'm tired, so I need a nap. So hopefully at some point it will happen. So Edie has just woken up from my nap. It is about three o'clock. I'll be honest, I tried to have a little nap as well, which is why I look a bit um, puffy and uh, bedraggled. Uh, yeah, we're gonna, I'm going to teach you colours. In terms of her learning, something that you don't realise that's especially pertinent for single parents is how... Edie, do you want to come? Oh, you want to get down? Okay. Mummy's going to do this for you. Is when you're a parent, it dawns on you at some point that you are the one responsible for growing your child, teaching them. Everything that, like, a human being knows, the child knows you have to teach them. And when you're a single parent, it's all on yourself. I know, baby, I'm going to draw for you. And something we've not really done much of is colours. Um, I know, look, watch. We're not doing colouring in, baby. You can do drawing if you want. Let me just do this for you. So I'm drawing some coloured circles. And then, wow, well, they're supposed to be circles. Just scribbles. And I'm going to try and teach her about colours. Um, Edie is quite difficult to teach because she's so stubborn. She prefers learning herself. But I don't I don't want to do I don't want to do scribbling on everything. So we've got red, green, blue, yellow and pink. And we're just gonna focus on red, green and blue for now. Edie, watch, can you watch mummy? Look at this. Look at this, look at these colours. Look, watch, can I have your pointing finger? Pointing finger. Red, 
green, blue, yellow, pink. Good girl. Red, green, blue, yellow, pink. Right. It's red like a strawberry. That's red. Green like the trees. And that's blue like the sky. Where, Edie, where's red? Da, da. Mm. Da, da, da. That's green. Where's red? Da, da. No, that's yellow. Right, should we do it again? Let's do it again. Look. She just wants to colour in. I should have done this when she couldn't see the colour. Red. She likes pointing, so we'll do this for a bit. Red. Green. Blue. Yellow. Pink. Red, green, blue, yellow, pink. Red, green, blue. No, uh, well, what we can do is your learning book has got a book on colours, hasn't it? It's got a page on colours. Green, red, blue, yellow. Oh, it's getting advanced now. Purple, pink, orange and brown. Green, that's green, isn't it? That's red, that's blue. Edie, um, which one's red? Uh, which one's red? Dada. Good girl, she did it, good girl. Red. So that's, that's pretty much how learning goes in this household because she's a toddler, she doesn't have much patience, but I'm going to keep. Do you want the pink one as well? That's green. That's beautiful green. What about red? Red. Can we put the lid back on the green one though? That's a crayon baby, so you need to press harder. Good girl. Yeah, you can do it. Look, you just have to press harder. <laughs> or you can throw it. So she's fed up of that activity already. <laughs> I've done that now, so we can pick that up throughout the day because yeah. colours isn't something that we've mastered. Edie, pass that to Mummy. Can I have it? Yeah. Ta, good girl. She's very polite. That's one thing. She's very polite. Yeah, colours isn't something we've done much of. I think because her speech is a little bit, it's quite a lot behind. I actually, um, she's been referred to speech and language therapy. Uh, yeah, you want to do your colours? Um, I called the health visitor yesterday. Um, ta. ta, thank you. That was very kind. I called the health visitor yesterday because the doctor had asked her to be referred to speech and language therapy um, and to have a hearing test done. Uh, because by her age, she should ta. be... Ta, thank you. Ta. Oh, that's a piece of... Fluff, thank you. That's very kind. Can I have a kiss? <laughs> no. Um, so, yeah, I haven't had a chance. So the doctor asked her to be referred because um, the health visitor usually does it at her age. I hadn't had a chance because of with everything going on, I figured they were really busy. Um, but I called yesterday and I said, look, I know if I know it's not important, but I thought if there's a waiting list of a few months, it just means that I've at least got the referral in. They said, no, no, it's absolutely the right thing to do. They then went through a few questions. Hey, baby. Uh, Where's your learning book? There you. Yeah, why don't you do your learning book with mummy? Should we do your learning book? Come and sit down and do your learning book with mummy. Good girl. Um, so we went through a few questions. She said, yeah, that's, she's quite delayed. Um, she's in the black zone, black area. So, I'm trying no, not no. to get stressed and worried about her, like speaking, because I obviously did with her walking and that, that was fine. That sorted itself out. But it is a worry. Um, from what I was told, her dad didn't speak until he was like four or five. They said he had to, oh, I don't know. Right. Edie, can you say bye bye? Oh, can you say bye bye? Say bye. Bye bye. Are you beautiful? Oh. 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 I love you so much. You're the bestest baby ever. Can I give you a kiss on the nose? Can I give you a kiss on the cheek? 
You ready? Is that Edie? Is that Edie? Do you, want, do you want to do a kiss? Do you want to do a kiss? No. Do you want to do a kiss? No. Oh! <laughs> That's a definite no. <laughs> Bye.